just wanted to be straight here. Oh, I don't think there's many players in the game that could screw this in and get back for the black on it, but many, many years. I saw Perry Manns do this like, on pop black. Oh, that's Good effort. Very difficult. <laughs> He's got the double kiss. It's a, still an ongoing. And there you are, his favourite now. Is it? Six. He needs one ball. But after that, Trump's stock is six. Rose even more. Side chance of going in the left middle. This no, he's played it differently. <laughs> so a wee spot. Time's not over. Seven. Yes, the regulation number of balls in this frame not sufficient to determine a winner. Another brilliant shot. The shot is on, but you've still got to execute it. Got to watch the cue ball here. Right. Oh, goodness me. <laughs> How close. An absolutely fabulous shot from Maguire. Brilliant shot. You do well to see a better duel than this, Phil. These two. They'd rather go a little bit further down and play. The back to safety. This time there's just a glimmer. minutes on the colours. Yes. But the marathon is over. Seven. And the Ended by a Good potter try. extraordinaire. Get on the pink or even just make sure the red goes in and worry about the next shot. Oh, well. Wow. Well. Well. You would never think the cue ball was going to go on the floor there, would you? From that shot. Now. Phil, I think you're lost for words, aren't you? It's not, not, you've not moved since that shot took place. Oh, he'd be pleased to have played the ball. First one since phone one. Kind of turn things around. Why? One. Things are changing. Wow. Now he's hit the black. <laughs> That's what he tried first time. Red was on a side cushion here. Trump would feel a lot more secure. 
Mm, especially so now. in the way of the red. Providing the black spot is free at all. If not, it'll go up on the pink spot. 30. The balls could barely be placed better. And see what? Seven. Always makes sense to play for the blue off the last red to drop on the ball killers, but he's overcooked it. Yeah, that looks okay. Thirty one. Thirty-four. Just four points away from what would be a gutsy frame win. Well, oh, that's weighted perfectly also. Thirty-eight. Forty-three. But every credit to Steve Maguire for withstanding the barrage. Thank you. Twenty six. Trump, 26. Whenever you play a cannon, just take your eye off the pot. It wasn't a sitter. One. he doesn't catch one of the red stick he can po probably move the other three in the left got into it too much caught it thick just okay Seventy. Seventy five. But Maguire's miss now. Now can Trump now punish that mistake? One. Of course, he's won four ranking titles this season. Nine. 
it depends how he feels about the black. And that's what he's thinking now. Do I fancy the black from close to the side, Kush? Good shot in the red, but I think when he was 3-0, 3-1 in front, he would have played the one down the cushion. Nice positional shot he's played in the blue. He can almost pick his spot for this red. Points are almost immaterial, the way things stand in this frame. It's going to be all about the last red. I think he's going to try and shift it. Rather than, oh, he's had a big bounce there, has he? Hmm, hard to tell. Once again, the conundrum. You roll it in, you probably pot it, but if you miss it, you probably lose the frame. Trump, 33. Mm. Yeah. Yes, Trump just needs the red. First of all, Maguire's got to hit it. now on this red wow doesn't want the in off he's okay well that was uh... yeah went the first one it was the the good percentage way of playing it certainly got the snooker easy hit This is the chance he's been waiting for. And working for. Plunges in the red. And he's set for another steal. So once again, Steve McGuire needs the six colours. And it would be his Four. fourth frame in a row. Okay. No. Pink being where it is actually helps Steve in a touch here because, you know, although the blue's off the spot, you can can afford to be a wee bit low in the blue and still have a comfortable pink. So anything around straight and it should be job done. 30. Views and ours. It's just a little cut back this black. And in it goes. This is turning into the match of the tournament. And Stephen Maguire is it for friend. It's another excellent clearance from him. Eight. Oh, that's a gem. Oh, what a shot. Needs some help. And it's not the worst. Not bad. Oh, shot. 24. Judd's pulling the trigger here on this long red. Got to get this. Oh, 
Was that rash? A wee bit of desperation, perhaps? Thank you. No reason for him to play it with a 21-point lead and one red safe. Is he trying to do to Stephen what Stephen's what? been doing to him the last you know, second part of this match, which is almost bully, Judd? We don't see that very often. Is he on it? Maybe just a flick of right hand side. And it was a bit of right hand side to bend the cue ball. Let's see, 22 in front of the last red. It's going to be something like that with the last red to tackle. There's no doubt the way he's played has affected Trump's thinking. It's affected his shot choice selection. And it's out of his hands. He sat in that seat, clearly looking a bit edgy. 23. If he could finish top side of the pink, he could release the other red off the second last one. That'll keep, though. This is not easy. He's going to try and pinch the pocket here. Pot it as straight as possible. Mm. 21. Judd Trump is following Stephen Maguire. He's not even blinking, Judd. He's so intent on looking for information. He wants to know how difficult this shot is for Stephen. Yeah. yeah, look at him. Can't take his eyes off him. Is he playing pink ball. the pink to release the red this time round? My, what a shot this would be to pull off. It looks a natural. He's playing the cannon on the red by the cushion. Oh. Well, by mistake, but what a pot. <laughs> what a pot. <laughs> 16 to the good. Now a confident Judd Trump tries to pot this red and release that tough one. You see the replay, that was difficult. How's he feeling? Does he fancy playing it with deep screw? Pressure on every shot here. situation but the pressure is still on he's still got to pop these 30 and he's saying to Steve Maguire I'm still here I haven't Six. gone you put me under pressure but I can do the same to you he needs brown blue and pink and we're going into frame 10 20 I think this is the best match we've seen all week. That's and the good news is we've got more to come. If he pots this. He's been asked a lot of questions this evening. And in this frame, he's found the answer. What he wants. And the crack. What a match. Good and Judd Trump is still alive. convince himself if he can get through past the pink for this. Fun. No, he couldn't. 
in a miss. Now it's all about what he leaves. To Trump, six. One. Of course, earlier when Trump flicked the black, he flicked it safe, which is my thing to be. Any decider is going to be interesting, but it comes off the back of 10 great friends of snooker. Oh, it's dead set. It's a certainty. An absolute blot to, to pot it. Can he get the cue ball out of there? Yes, he can. And he's on the pink. If it slows up. Oh, it hasn't but blue. Wasting no time trying to nullify the pressure. That's all part of the game plan. And deciders try to get it over and done with as quickly as possible. So you don't have to think too much about it. Fabulous. <laughs> head to head favoured Trump. 12 8. The only two deciders, though, that they played have both been won by Maguire. Seven. <coughs> Fifty. This is up there with exactly what you want. Able to build probably 40, 50 point lead before having to play cannons. The right side of one of them and bring others into play like this here. Let's see where he's going with the cue ball. It's deep. He's bringing reds out. Oh, I'm amazed Fancy. at that. Why didn't he go deep and push reds out and just bring the cue ball into the middle of the table? I'm astonished at that shot. Shots real at the end of the week for me. That black's got to be up there. From Trump's perspective, something needs to go wrong soon. Forty-four. And it has. He's counting the yellow. Slightly wrong side of the blue. He's caught the yellow. So I hope for Trump. 49 in it. This situation is a bit more critical than normal. His next bad shot will probably be his last.
Betsy. This is heading for a thrilling finish, this decider. Another one. And what it shows as well, you give these fellas, these top players in snooker of today, the platform and the everyone absolutely engrossed in this at the minute. We're in for what looks like a certain finish in the colours. He's promoted one of the Orford Reds. Still pressure on every shot, though. Oh, that's some shot. That is some shot. Now, I think Judd's got the plan in here. Four. Now, yeah, loan the brown, loan the next red. And he's on it, and he can shove the other red. Just nestle it over the other middle pocket. Awkward bridging for a left-hander. But not, not too bad. All about the cannon. He's got it. Wow, what a shot to pull out in the decider. And if he wins now, it's more impressive than had he won 6-0 in a couple of hours because he's been asked serious 40. questions. He's been put under all sorts by Steve Maguire. He just took a few seconds to decide which order to take these last six colours. He's hoping for a right twist. <laughs> Match of the tournament, this, in terms of quality, drama, excitement. Can he finish the job right here and now? Well, there's no not. certainty. Well, he needs the blue. He'll be 15 in front with 13 on, so... This is match ball barring snookers. What a player he is. What a player he's become. It's not just about the skill, which isn't in question. It's about the temperament. And he has shown that in spades this evening. This is one of his best wins of the season. It really is. He was 3-0 up. He was in control. Stephen Maguire fought back. Put him under all sorts. And Judd Trump. The player of the year has responded. What a clearance that is to win it. He's the first man into the Players' Championship final. He's beaten Stephen Maguire 6-5. What a match.